a deck of cards in addition to trying to play cards, but playing cards in space is actually kind of difficult because as soon as you deal one out, they go flying all the way. But a deck of cards makes another interesting demonstration, which is you can use it as a nice uh, satellite and demonstrate how uh, when you spin things along their, uh, uh, their widest axis, this is called a maximal inertial axis, uh, it flies very stably. If you spin a, uh, a deck of cards along its uh, uh, thinnest line, its uh, minimal axis, it flies very well. But if you spin a deck of cards or any other uh, block uh, rectangular object uh, in anything other than its maximum or minimum axis, watch what happens. It actually will, oh, here we go, let me see if I can keep the camera here. It'll actually tumble. Do you see how it twists every now and then? That twist is a very unusual phenomenon uh, that is true of spinning objects in space. So a deck of cards makes some very interesting games and demonstrations that you can do in space.